ladies and gentlemen today we are going to talk about limb girdle muscular dystrophy limb girdle muscular dystrophy is a bilateral proximal weakness of the muscles and the disease is genetically transmitted usually patients at an age of 20 plus or sometimes like 25 to 30 they start showing weakness in their muscles particularly larger group of muscles of the hip and the shoulder girdle and clinically what we can see in these patients is that when they squat it is very difficult for them to get up going upstairs is very difficult for them and gradually this weakness keeps increasing similarly their girdle uh, weakness of the shoulder also progressively increases as they tend to uh, do something at the shoulder level they get easily fatigued and this weakness keeps increasing the point to be to be made clear at this stage is that all patient with limb girdle muscular dystrophy they must ensure that they do not put up a lot of weight they must control their weight they must not overexert because overexertion or a lot of exercises are not good for limb girdle muscular dystrophies as far as medicinal treatment is concerned so they can occasionally take vitamins but there is no definite role of steroids although at uh, times we give anabolic steroids to these patients but there is no well proven role of steroids in limb girdle muscular dystrophy as far as braces are concerned lot of doctors give them braces Braces are not contraindicated, but they are always not very supportive. Sometimes they cause uh, aggressiveness in the treatment, particularly because these patients, when they are put to rest due to a brace, that limb starts uh, deteriorating. So I personally suggest all such patients should always refer to their rehabilitation consultants. And then every treatment for a limb girdle patient should be tailored made. And of course, they need a lot of psychotherapy and social support. If they are students, usually this period of disability starts after their studentship. So, on job uh, environmental changes which have to be made friendly uh, for the patients are more recommended. I hope if taken care of these things, the patient can live a reasonably good lifestyle. Thank you.